Hey, what's up? Uh, welcome back to my channel 3D Creation with Blender. Um, this time I'm uh, celebrating. I'm celebrating uh, 10,000 views in my previous video. Um, some of you may remember that uh, I said I would uh, uh, do some retopology and uh, texturing and rigging to my um uh Jordu shell um sculpt this was an uh a fifties uh, style retro alien alien head so here we go um uh, I'm gonna try to explain uh the process um um I usually um start with topology um, by uh, creating the loops e around the eyes. This is the first uh, thing I uh, I do. Um, right right now uh, I'm doing a couple of uh, loops around the the left eye. As uh, some of you already know. Uh, we we work in only one half of the model because uh, later we can use the the mirror modifier to uh, complete or make uh, or, or low poly model complete. Um, there you can see the the main loops that. Um, uh, Conform the the face. These are the the loops that uh, makes our model uh, deform properly when we are doing an uh, uh, an animation where we are animating our model. Um, uh, this uh, this uh, our workflow. Um, it's based on projection. Um, in the bottom of the of our screen, there's a there's a toolbar, and in that toolbar, uh, there's an option. So uh, in edit mode, um, so uh, every vertex we we move can be projected into or onto the another um, mesh or another object so uh, I'm using this option to project everything onto the the high poly mesh this is quite uh, <laughs> It's quite a job if you can get any of the of the plugins on Blender Market. Uh, go ahead. Um, you can use uh, the contours that uh, I, I, I believe it's uh, it's made by the guys at uh, at Blender Cookie. Fine, fine plugin. Right. Uh, Right now I'm doing this only with the the default tools uh, in Blender. There's also another plugin that is uh, already um, uh, inside Blender. It's included. It's called um, what is called B surfaces, I believe. B surfaces. But uh, I think in the, it's not working so well in the last uh, version of Blender, so we're going to we're not going to use it now. Okay, I'm doing the the back of the head. This is uh, I think this this is the easiest part. And now I'm going to get into the ears. That's uh, that's problematic working on the ears. There you can see I'm only working in one half of the mesh and completing it 
with the uh, mirror modifier. We need to check that our normals are all pointing outside the mesh. And before, usually before I apply the, the mirror modifier, I like to uh, do the the cuts for the UV the UV layer. So when I um, apply that uh, the, the mirror modifier, I already have everything. Uh, I mean double. <laughs> you'll see. You'll see what I'm trying to to say. There, you see, uh, the mirror modifier uh, copies those uh, seams. Then I only got, have to uh, do a couple of, of uh, seams more. And ready. Ready to, to unwrap. And this is not the final um, UV layer, but uh, it's uh, enough for us to, to see the process. Um, when we do the automatic weights when parenting uh, a model to an armature, well, this is not a magical tool. Uh, we, are, we always have to fine-tune manually, fine-tune the, the weights. There, the the jawbone is uh, is deforming the the face of our model, but uh, we need to um, to paint some more. Ah, uh, that's right. But we need to. We we're gonna need to to include some shape keys to to fix some deformations. Uh, in the model I'm going to include um, well, I, I, I already include uh, two two maps uh, a diffuse, diffuse map and a normal map. The specular it's, uh, I'm, I'm going to use some vertex colors. And I'm going to show you the, the first uh, version of the armature. This is just the structural bones. I call them structural because they they move <laughs> they they move the the model. The rest of the bones are going to be shape keys bones and um, helper bones. Okay, there you go. there is the finished rig. Now I'm going to try to explain what uh, everything uh, does, does okay that's no mystery let's see the, the head neck jawbone ears those are structural bones the neck has a a scale uh, transformation. There's uh, eyelids and the ears. Let's get into the shape keys bones. 
all the ship keys uh, are uh, have drivers so they are tied to the armature there are bones like the one that you are seeing right now that control more than one shape key okay let's see the the job when when it opens this is a uh, this is quite problematic. Those arrows control the smile and uh, another um, expression, a uh, duck face expression. And uh, those uh, circular ch shapes control uh, the cheek bones uh, it looks like uh, it's uh, blowing Let's see some uh, final animation. I did, well, I, I did a small animation just to just to show all the expressions and what can be done with this uh, armature. Um, this uh, this model is uh, is already available to download for free in uh, blendswap.com. You can get it uh, get it there. So well, um, I hope uh, I hope you liked uh, this uh, video and uh, don't forget to subscribe. See ya.